answering uh, Tony C's question from the reply I saw on the video from the MHI VRF lower box setup. Yes, the panels, uh, the side panels do come off of service. Actually, the right side panel, if you look from behind the box, has to come off of service. And that's where you have all the refrigerant pipes, the comms cables, and electric coming in through. The rear one has to be removed for service, as you saw in the video, for cleaning. The three units are installed on the rack, as seen in, in, the, in this video. And the, the spacing that you see in one of the pictures, we make like a type of wall with a duckboard so it won't so it won't blow out. The supply is a common supply, and the return plenum is a common box with filters inside. There's not filters for each machine, if that's one of the if that's the answer. Also, in some cases there's filters for each machine. In some cases, it said to return in the inside. We put a as a filter grill. We use just the one inch disposable media. So there's a grill there. It's for it. We install the filter in it. So I think that covers the questions that were asked. Let me see if I remember any more. It's one. All three go to one supply. For the air pressure so. It's a high static setup. And the blowers are not ECM, they're constant speed. So that's another question. And the setup is good up to uh you could that one machine does up to 20 tons with the three blowers, and you can add condensers up to up your tonnage. We have another setup like that, it's 40 tons with four with six units, so the possibilities of combinations are virtually endless.